Hi, David here. I'd like to take this opportunity to talk to you a little bit about binocular vision. Now that's vision where your eyes are parallel to the ground. You know, golf's kind of strange because it's a side on game where we're standing on the side of the golf ball, but our golf ball is going to a target that we don't really have our eyes directly over unless you're putting. But more specifically, have you ever gotten behind a golf ball, lined it up, and then got around to the side of it and looked at it and said to yourself, no, that can't be right. Well, there's two, there's a good angel and a bad angel going on right now. The binocular vision person is a person who sees a putt, let's say again, it's right edge, and you're gonna line that up and you're gonna take a look at it and you're confident with that. And then you move on over to the side and you look at it and your brain says, no, that can't be right edge. I'll just try to hit it in the hole. You hit it in the hole, it breaks away from the hole and you say, geez, I, I knew that was right edge. Why did I do that? So there's this uh, little disconnect when you stand on the side of the golf ball looking at it with this kind of eyesight versus this looking at it with binocular vision. So what's the, what's the tip? Trust your binocular vision. And when you get down there and you line up your putt, take a look at it. Even go back here and take a look at it. And then trust what you saw back there, even though you may feel and see something different right here. And that's why having or using the line on the golf ball is so important. You know, Jack Nicholas for years had his uh, stance open and he kind of craned his neck and looked to see where he was going. Uh, ben Crenshaw also did the same thing. And I, I think that what they were doing was they were kind of trying to reestablish the original, original read, the initial read, so they could trust where to start the ball. So again, trust your binocular vision, not the side-on vision here, and you'll make more putts. Good luck with that, and I'll see you on the next tip.